welcome to tutorial 8 on Windows 7, uh, something called pinning. Uh, this is actually uh, very useful as, uh, for quick access. So many people may remember in Windows XP you can always drag your icons to the start menu or next to the start menu to easy access. Um, on Windows 7 they call this pinning or pin to the actual taskbar. So um, down here, this is the actual start menu along here. Um, what people always get confused about, this is called the task bar. As, uh, as well, this is where all your tasks run. So what we're going to be doing is taking one of my folders or files and I'm going to be pinning this to the actual task bar so, uh, for access. So I want to access my, say, my... Um, so I want to back up, I want to actually uh, access maybe this game that I have for quick access if I don't have a desktop icon, but for the moment I do. So I want to pin, I've got an option pin to start menu or pin to taskbar. I want to pin that to the actual taskbar. So I click on that and you can see a nice new icon has appeared. So my next one I want to appear, either pin is uh, Steam client. So I want to pin that to the taskbar. Again, and a new icon appears next to the start menu. So, uh, so that's very easy to do. So it's just two or three mouse clicks to uh, pin the items to the taskbar. If you want to remove them, if you say, "Oh, hang on, but I made a mistake," I can right-click on here, and there is an option unpin this program from taskbar. Click on that, and off it comes. I don't want my Steam client anymore on the taskbar. Right-click, unpin from taskbar. And that's all there is to it. Mm -hmm. So pretty easy to uh, desktop uh, easy access shortcuts uh, via the pinning method in Windows 7.